Hi, I'm Karen Morrow. And I'm Greg Schreiner. I started this workshop 27 years ago, and we discovered that over 700 students have gone through the program. Two years ago, because of COVID, we were forced to go online with Zoom. It was kind of fun, actually. Singers come to us to sharpen their vocal skills as well as their verbal skills. Uh, in fact, we found that the lyrics, the words, are actually as important as the music. Every song tells a story, so here are some swell stories. and Karen's workshop feel this way about the music. It's who we are. Now, this next song was written by Richard Whiting with lyrics by Johnny Mercer. I search for phrases to sing your praises but there aren't any Magic adjectives to tell you all you are. You're just too marvelous, too marvelous for words like rapturous, fabulous. Your voice is tintinabulous. It's all so wonderful an ordinary word like magical mystical seems much too apathistical the sweetest words in Keats and Shelley's lyrics aren't sweet enough to be the 
simple delirious You're simply too spectacular to be in my vernacular And so you see I'm faced to go to the birds To tell you you're colossal You made my whole life possible And you marvelous was by Matt Dennis and Earl Brent. And this song from 1980 is by Leonard Cohen, Jennifer Warnes, and William Elliott. There was a child named Bernadette. I heard the story long ago. Thank you. 
I'm 10 years old, living in New Jersey. My uncle, on leave from World War II, takes me to my first Broadway show, Oklahoma. I fell in love with musicals and have loved them ever since. Here's the opener. There's a bright golden haze on the meadow. There's a bright golden haze on the meadow. The corn is as high as an elephant's eye. And it looks like it's climbing clear up to the sky. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. I got a beautiful feeling. Everything's going my way. All the cattle are standing like statues. All the cattle are standing like statues. They don't turn their heads as they see me ride by. But a little brown maverick is waking her eye. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. I got a beautiful feeling. Everything's going my way. All the sounds of the earth are like music. All the sounds of the earth are like music. The breeze is so busy, it don't miss a tree. And an old weeping willer is laughing at me. Oh, what a beautiful morning. Oh, what a beautiful day. I got a beautiful feeling. Everything's going my way. Oh, what a beautiful day. Love is such a fantastic affair when it comes to call. After taking you up in the air, down it lets you fall. But be patient and soon you will find, if you follow your heart, not your mind, love is waiting there again to take you up in the air again. When love comes in and takes you for a spin, ooh la la la, say magnifica. When every night your loved one holds you tight, ooh la la la, Say magnifica. But when one day your love one drifts away, ooh la la la, it's so tragica. But when once more she whispers, je t'adore, say magnifica. They're playing songs of love, but not for me. A lucky star above, but not for me. With love to lead the way, I find more clouds of grey than any Russian play could guarantee. Well, guarantee, guarantee.
guarantee us if there are any guarantees in love, darling. I mean, fat or thin, it doesn't matter. And speaking of fat, a very dear friend of mine, Beatrix Fairfax, said to me the other day, oh, you've gained too much weight, you're so fat. And I said, oh, thank you, dear. Thank you for telling me. Did you think I hadn't noticed? And then there are all those cheerful Pollyannas who tell me I should diet. It's all bananas. They're serving egg and chips, but not for me. They're serving salsa dips, but not for me. I dream of food all day. It's my eternal play. Oh, how my taste buds miss that sense of bliss. I was a fool to dream of cherry pie. The very thought of it gets me so high. But I just know these thighs are growing size by size. I guess it's not for me. They're serving rack of lamb, but I want ham. The very thought of pig just flips my wig. Because you know they're smart, they're coming from the heart, and they have minds much clearer than you or I. Oh yes, the thought of food just drives my day. The taste, the scent, the smell makes me so gay. I just can't give it up. It simply fills my cup. Oh, how I love my food. <laughs> oh, food. What's not to love about food? I love to cook, I love to eat. But you know, it was Shakespeare who said, if music be the food of love, play on. But I truly think now that the true food of love is the power of positive thinking because we all need it so much. We all need to join together thinking positively if we're going to save our absolutely beautiful earth. Fairy tales can come true. They can happen to you if you're young at heart. For it's hard you will find to be narrow of mind if you're young at heart. You can go to extremes with impossible schemes. You can laugh when your dreams fall apart at the seams. And life gets more exciting with each passing day. And love is either in your heart or on its way. Don't you know that it's worth every treasure on earth to be young at heart? For as rich as you are, it's much better by far to be young at heart. And if you could survive to a hundred and five, think of all you derive out of being alive. And this is the best part. You get a head start if you are among the very young. Places undone and floor, making heart won't hurt anymore. In my arms I'll hold you some more and sing you a lullaby. Breathing in and breathing slow, candles flicker in your glow. Maybe just in my
The next song I'd like to sing is one that I discovered a couple of months ago when I turned 65 and was looking for music that had been written the year I was born that nobody had heard of. And I ran across this song, which was written for a movie called 10,000 Bedrooms. And the reason nobody heard it is because the movie flopped. They use the phrase, I love you, a thousand different ways. I hope that I won't hurt that phrase if I desert that phrase, if I invert that phrase. You, I love the kind of passion you fashion could not be explained. You, I love, you're so appealing, the feeling cannot be contained. And when I touch you, There's no chill, and yet I shiver. There's no flame, and yet I burn. I'm not sure what I'm afraid of, and yet I'm trembling. There's no storm, but I hear thunder, and I'm breathless. Why, I wonder, weak one moment, then the next I'm fine. I feel as if I'm falling every time I close my eyes. And flowing through my body is a river of surprise. Feelings of awakening that I scarcely recognize as mine. What are all these new sensations? What's the secret they reveal? Did it all begin with him? And the way he makes me feel? I'm weak one moment, then the next I'm fine. written in 1962. Peel me grape, 
crush me some ice. Skin me a peach, it save the buzz for my pillow. Oh, yeah, it's so nice. You gotta wind me and dine me. Don't try and fool me, be jewel me. Now either amuse me or you're gonna lose me. I'm getting hungry. Peel me a grape. Pop me a cork, a French bean fry. Crack me a nut and bring a bowl full of bonbons. Till we whine and keep standing by. Ah, you entertain me, champagne me, show me you love me, honey. Kid, love me. Best way to cheer me, cash me, me. I'm getting hungry. Peel me a grape, here's me an agreeable chap. You gotta love me and leave me in luxury's lap. So hop when I holler and skip when I snap. When I say do it just, hop to it and send out for scotch. Now boil me a crab, cut me a rose and make my tea from the petals. Just hang around to pick up the chub. Polar bear bug me, and then don't bug me. Show me you love me, you gotta love me. You thunderbird me, hey, you hurt me. I'm getting hungry. Peel me a grape. Honey, make it the seedless kind. This song was written by a songwriter who spent most of his career here in Hollywood in the 20s and 30s. Walter Donaldson wrote over 600 songs, but poor Walter was kind of looked down upon by his peers in the songwriting community as being too pedestrian, unsophisticated. But yet he turned out hit after hit. Songs like My Blue Heaven, Little White Lies, Love Me or Leave Me, and this song from 1927 that first caught my attention when I heard it in the movie the Joker's Wild. Every little breeze is crying a love undying at sundown. Every little birdie's resting, feather nesting at sundown. Each little rosebud is sleeping while shadow are creeping in a little cottage cozy life's rosy at sundown where a loving smile will meet me and greet me at sundown i seem to sigh i'm in heaven when night is falling love's calling me home in a little cottage cozy, life's rosy at sundown. Where a loving smile will meet me and greet me at sundown. I seem to sigh I'm in heaven when night is falling and love's calling me home. Now I know the country and the world has been going through a pretty tough time over the last couple of years. But we've been through tough times before. And I'd like to sing a song that takes us back to one of those. This was probably known best as the anthem of the Great Depression. They used to tell me I was building a dream. And so I followed the mob. When there was earth to plow or guns to bear, I was always there right on the job. They used to tell me I was building a dream with peace and glory ahead. Why should I be standing in line just waiting for bread? Once I built a railroad, made it run, made it race against time. 
once I built a railroad, now it's done. Brother, can you spare a dime? Once I built a tower to the sun, brick and rivet and line. Once I built a tower, and now it's done. Brother, can you spare a dime? Once in fancy suits, gee, we look swell, full of that Yankee doodly dum. A half a million boots went slogging through hell. I was the kid with a drum. Say, don't you remember? They call me Al. It was Al all the time. Say, don't you remember? I'm your pal, brother. Can you spare a dime? I've always loved Noel Coward songs. They're so witty. And I'm going to sing one for you now, and it's from his show called Sail Away. Travel, they say, improves the mind, an irritating platitude, which really entre nous is very far from true. Personally, I've yet to find that longitude and latitude can educate those scores of monumental boars who travel in groups and herds and various breeds and sexes while the whole world reels from the shouts and squeals and the clicking of roller flexes. Why do the wrong People travel, travel, travel When the right people stay back home What compulsion compels them And who the hell tells them To drag their bags to Zanzibar Instead of saying quietly in Omaha The Taj Mahal and the Grand Canal And the sunny French Riviera Would be less oppressed if the Middle West would settle for some place rather nearer, millions of tourists are churning up the gravel while they gaze at St. Peter's Dome. But why, oh why, do the wrong people travel when the right people stay back home and mind their business? When the right people stay back home with Cinerama, when the right people stay back home, I'm merely asking, when the right people stay back home, why do the wrong people travel, 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 when the right people stay back home? What is this mass mania? to leave Pennsylvania and clack around like flocks of geese demanding dry martinis on the Isles of Greece. They'll take a train or an aeroplane for an hour to the Costa Brava to see Pompeii on the very day when it's up to its tush in molten lava. Please do not think that I criticize or cavil at a genuine urge to roam. But why, oh why, do the wrong people travel when the right people stay back home and eat hot donuts? When the right people stay back home with Ethel Merman? When the right people stay back home, won't someone tell me? When the right people stay back home. This is a song that I love. I call it a perfect song. And it was written by two gentlemen who I've never heard of, never heard from again. They wrote one perfect song and that was it. <laughs> I can only give you love that lasts forever And a promise to be near each time you call And the only heart I own For you and you alone At 
als ob, als ob. I can only give you country walks in springtime and a hand to hold when leaves begin to fall and a love whose burning light will warm the winter night that's all that's all there are those i am sure who have told you they would give you the world for a toy all i have are these arms to enfold you and a love time can never destroy if you're wondering what i'm asking in return dear you'll be glad to know that my demands are small say it's me that you'll adore from now and Never more, that's all. That's all. I was surprised to learn that this was an Academy Award winning song, but it won the Oscar for Best Song in 1945, beating out I Couldn't Sleep a Wink Last Night and Long Ago and Far Away. From the movie Going My Way, written by Jimmy Van Heusen and Johnny Burke. Would you like to swing on a star, carry moonbeams home in a jar, and be better off than you are? Or would you rather be a mule? A mule is an animal with long funny ears, kicks up at everything he hears. His back is brawny, but his brain is weak. He's just plain stupid with a stubborn streak. And by the way, if you hate to go to school, you may grow up to be a mule. Or would you like to swing on a star, carry moonbeams home in a jar, and be better off than you are? Or would you rather be a pig? A pig is an animal with dirt on his face. His shoes are a terrible disgrace. He has no manners when he eats his food. He's fat and lazy and extremely rude. But if you don't care a feather or a fig, you may grow up to be a pig. Or would you like to swing on a star, carry moonbeams home in a jar, and be better off than you are? Or would you rather be a fish? A fish won't do anything but swim in a brook. He can't write his name or read a book. To fool the people is his only thought. And though he's slippery, he still gets caught. But then if that sort of life is what you wish, you may grow up to be a fish. And all the monkeys aren't in the zoo. Every day you meet quite a few. So you see, it's all up to you. You could be swinging on a star. You could be swinging, swinging on a star. I left Los Angeles about a year ago after living there for 40 years and decided to move back to where I was from. I'm happy with the choice that I've made. It's very quiet and peaceful. Nature is all around me and the grass and the trees are the most beautiful shade of green. It's my new paradise. How wonderful that I'm beholding a never, never land unfolding Where we polish up the stars And mountains we move In a life 
where all our pleasures we will prove. It's a new have rolled off my cheek and fears fade away every time you speak a new world though we're in a tiny room what a vision of joy and blossom and bloom a new-found promise, one that will last, so I'm holding on, and I'm holding fast. You've brought a new world to me, and that it'll chosen a song from the Oscar-winning musical, La La Land. Barefoot she smiled and leapt without looking and tumbled into the sand. The water was freezing. She spent the month sneezing and said she would do it. Again. Here's to the ones who dream, foolish as they may seem. Here's to the hearts that ache. Here's to the mess we make. She captured a feeling, a sky with no ceiling, a sunset inside. Rain. She lived in her liquor and died with a flicker. I'll always remember the flame. Here's to the ones who dream, foolish as they may seem. Here's to the hearts of to the mess we make. She told me a bit of madness is key to use the colors we see. Who knows where it will lead us? And that's why they need us. So bring on the rebels, the ripples painters and poets and plays and here's to the fools who dream crazy as they may seem here's to the hearts that ache here's to the mess we make Trace it all back to then. Her and the snow and the sand. Smiling through it, she said she would do it again.
brought the sun and the flowers where there used to be rain. My yesterday's blue, dear. Today I'm part of you, dear. My lonely hours I'm through, dear. Since you said you were mine, what a difference a day made. There's a rainbow before me. Skies above can't be stormy. Since that moment of bliss, that thrilling kiss, it's heaven when you find romance on your menu. What a difference a day made. And the difference is you. Since that moment of bliss, that thrilling kiss, it's heaven when 